of aiming the transport of prisoner Cook Snake Rattler on the way there. We are being attacked by a tow truck attempting to help the prisoner escape. Request immediate backup. High speed pursuit underway. Update, the police have managed to secure the prisoners. G'day everyone, welcome today we're looking at LEGO set 60276 LEGO City Police Prisoner Transport. This set was released in 2021, it contains 244 pieces and 4 minifigs. And this set typically retails for around $32.99. Keen to see what they've done with this set and how much is involved, it looks like there are a few vehicles to build and play with so cannot wait to get into it and attempt to answer the question, is it worth it? So make sure you stick around for that but before we jump into the video could you please hit that like button, consider subscribing if you haven't already so you don't miss any more videos like this in the future. Now let's get into building building this set together. This is Clara, the criminal code CTY1256. And here she is with her accessories, which include this hat and goggles. This is Duke Detain code CTY1257. And as you can see, he comes with two faces. He also comes with two accessories, which include this hairpiece and this helmet. So we're just starting to add stickers now. This is a number plate detail. So here we've just finished building the bad guys tow truck. You can see the dynamite sticks attached to the side there. You've also got the chain and the hook at the back, which we'll be using a little bit later on. Looks pretty mean. So now here we've just added some police stickers to this motorbike to make it look more like a, well, a police motorbike. And there we just finish it off with some lights and handcuffs attached to the back. And this here, this is Crook Snake Rattler, code CTY1130. <laughs> and here they are, their accessories, which include this cowboy hat. And this is female police officer CTY1258. And as you can see, she has two faces there, a calm one and then kind of a frightened one. She also comes with these accessories, which include a hat and a hairpiece, which is all in one. So now we're at the end of bag two, and as you can see, we've added a bit of detail there to the interior of the truck and the front with the police sticker, the coffee mug, the steering wheel, the handcuffs, and other little details like that. So now let's finish this set off. I really did like these small windows. They just add a bit more detail to the truck and give it that glass pane look. added these police stickers to these 4x1s. So we're just building the prison compartment now which clicks onto the back and with one press of the button it comes bouncing off. So you can see that's how the prisoner is going to escape and it just clicks on really simple. Click. So there we go that's this set all finished up. The main big attraction is this police transporter then you've got the other tow truck and the motorcycle as well as four minifigs to play with in this set so let's talk about this set in a bit more detail as we get into reviews for buildability like most city sets there are always multiple objects to build this set enables you to build all of the necessary vehicles for a fun high-speed chase the bad guy's unique tow truck design looks mean and aggressive especially with the dynamite bundles hanging off the side this set was an enjoyable build, however I felt like it could have used a few more details, a few extra pieces, just to give this set a little bit more, and especially with that tow truck, the wheels could have been a little bit bigger, they just felt a little bit too small for me. So for buildability, I'm giving this set a score of 7 out of 10. For looks, this set achieves that typical LEGO City police look. In regards to the colour scheme, it's easy to identify the police as the blue and white versus the bad guys who are usually in black and red. The look of the tow truck I did like, however the wheels just felt disproportionately too small for the body that they were on. Besides from that, there really isn't anything amazing about the look or design of this set. It's pretty much straightforward and you get what you see. So for looks, I'm giving it a 5.3 out of 10. 
For playability, this set offers multiple vehicles and four minifigs to play with, which is more than enough to create multiple good guy and bad guy scenarios. The tow truck can actually hook up to the police transport and tow the cell half behind it. This set offers a range of functionality and fun, as well as that cell half of the prisoner transport being able to be detached with a single press of a button. So for playability, I'm giving this set a score of 8.6 out of 10. So in order to answer the question of is it worth it, we place this set based on its score on our newly developed scale of worth. With a total score of 20.9 out of 30, this set falls into the group of worth it. That's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful or entertaining, then please hit that like button. Consider subscribing if you don't want to miss any more videos like this in the future, and I will see you in the next one.